Well, there it is. How are we going to get it free? A push. But... Trust me. Ready. Dig in and push with everything. Yes, sir. Jump. Really? Come. Do not panic. Why would I panic? I have you. Right, you know that. Well, well, well. Good. We should keep moving. The chisel tip. Give the man credit. He has a talent for destroying things. Remember that head. Never leaves my mind. Those were the guys we saw with Balder. His nephews? Aye. Magni and Modi. The sons of Thor. Mother always said the Aesir were the worst of gods. And Thor was the worst of the Aesir. Guess he's a terrible father, too. They are no longer children. They have no excuse. Will Sindri be okay? They'll never even see him. Ah, the great dining hall. Envy of all Midgard. Funny. I remember there being a massive candelabrum. It really livened up the place. There. Ah, yes. <laughs> you just can't help but break things, can you? Memory serves. The Jarl's throne was just on the other side of that wall of ice.
finish it. Something ahead. See, Lodge? He's fine. Thought it best to vanish when Thor's idiot sons showed up. I know of a place that may contain some useful treasure. Let me think. Oh, very well. To business. Well, when you do need something, I'll be around. There's an abandoned temple in Midgard that a fellow dwarf converted to his personal storeroom. Packed it with all sorts of treasures he collected during his travels throughout the realms. Throughout the realms? Which ones did he go to? What did he collect? Fafnir was a, shall we say, aggressive collector of magical artifacts. The more he acquired, the more he desired. There was no realm too dangerous, no relic too hazardous. 
He once ventured deep into Niflheim for a whetstone of all things. Huh. I bet that was quite the whetstone. Does this story have a point? Yes, it does. I just happen to have an entry stone to Fafnir's storeroom. You might find something useful in there. Neat. Thanks, Sindri. You're very welcome. Oh, and uh, if you find that whetstone, well, it sure would be nice of you to bring it to me. I'd advise caution if you're heading to the storeroom. Last I was there, all manner of nasty had taken up residence. Won't your friend be upset if you still are stuck? Oh, <laughs> no. No, not at all. He's dead. Oh. No, no need to be sorry. These things happen when one travels from realm to realm collecting priceless artifacts that don't belong to you. Could you take a look at this? Honestly? I don't have much else going on right now. <laughs> Hurry, brother! We may get a piece of the chisel and be gone before they even notice. Uh oh. Yeah. Boy. Surrender. The old father demands it. No. Good. This fight is mine, boy. Go! And where do you think you're going? Oh no, brother! The little freak's got a bow! What are we gonna do? <laughs> Don't tell me! I can't remember the last time we faced an actual challenge. Call this a challenge. An old man in this still world. I'll take the You mean to oppose the might of Asgard. You've got some fun, kid. I always feel bad about it. Oh, no, no! Oh, there, draw there, lead there! I can't see! Stay behind me, boy. Why do you hunt us? What does Odin want? Oh, no. Don't care. Come here, Hathor. You're done now, Daddy's hand. Shut up! Don't call me that! Can't believe you blasted this door. Those skinny little arms can barely lift the door. I said shut up! Calm yourself, boy. Looks like they need another lesson. You are more than happy to teach, brother. Ha <laughs> ha! 
<laughs> for a disappointment. Oh, my man. Don't think we've forgotten. Jealous. Tell me all to yourself, do you? I'll take the small one. Son of a bitch! No, no. Ah, get the hell out of here! 
Sickness. The fever has returned. No. It hasn't. Roy. A coffin for blood. The boy's sick. He needs Freya. No. Steady. I'll be all right. There you go, lad. <clears throat> I'm fine, see? We should keep an eye on him. It's locked magically. Enough? Should do. With that, we can carve the travel room to Jotunheim. Get you where you need to go. Oh, incidentally, all those magically sealed doors we've seen can now be unlocked. Like that one round the corner. You can get through that door there now that you've got the chisel. He did. He was a god. But you killed him. Minor Aesir, perhaps. But I. And his father's Thor. Not minor. Not minor at all, him. This will not go over well in Asgard. I defended us. Nothing more. I fear no judgment. Judgment, no. But if vengeance is any concern. Since when can you kill a god? <coughs> Hey, son. Wait, we were here before. Which way back? Oh, the travelers. Oh, disgusting. Mm, smelly, covered in God knows how many little beasties, but gorgeous armor. Let's see if I can't make something more sanitary. Yes?
I don't think the lad's doing too well. I'm fine. <coughs> if so, then keep up. Yes, sir. Magni didn't come back to life. That is interesting. It's known the Aesir find their own way to Valhalla. No Valkyrie escort, no processing at the gates of Helheim. That may be significant. Giant's hand. What? What is this place? Fishermen would bring the day's catch into this port and use that contraption to send some of it directly to the Jarl's main kitchen. The rest were sorted and sold. There is an exit under the thumb. Find a way across. There is an opening. I can get it. There's a path to the exit on the other side. up here. <coughs> I think that did it. Back under his palm. We're almost there. A 
Atreus, here! Yes, Father! Everything we just did. Climbed around a dead giant, rode a giant falling hammer, fought some bad gods. What do you think Mother would say? Bet you have come a long way. Thanks. There's something over there! What now then? Maybe Freya ought to have a look at the boy. No, I feel better now. I just needed to catch my breath. Where do we go next? Well, now that we've got the giant's chisel, we need to learn the travel room to Jotunheim, so we can carve it into that special gateway atop the peak, and open realm travel to the land of the giants. You don't know it? Alas, no. But the serpent did mention that the giants had entrusted that secret to Tyr. Isn't Tyr dead? Aye, but his hidden boat is very much in reach. The doors are beneath his temple. Submerged in the lake for generations until our snake friend shifted his weight. There we shall find the fabled Black Rune of Jotunheim. We could also explore some more. We got that chisel now, and that vault isn't going in. It seems a shame to waste the boat. We shall see, boy. Mimir! You are in the middle of a story before. How would Freya agree to marry Odin? What was in it for her? It was a sacrifice to protect her people. A selfless act of love. Truly, she deserves better than she got. But of course, there's more to that story. Maybe I'm saying things. Tears fall. Another one of these. It's Tear, but the middle panel is missing. Wait, I thought Tear was a god, not a giant. Ah, but he was loved by everyone, including the giants. Other than me, he was the only one they gifted with their special sight. Hey, I wonder if the giants left a triptych about me somewhere, too. Go ahead. Actually, come look. Let me show you how to read this. That is not necessary. You've taught me so much. Let me teach you something. Atreus. Come on. You already speak it. Learning to read won't be that hard. I know how to read, boy. Just not this tongue. You're halfway there already, then. Okay. So the runes represent a lot of different things. Some gods, some animals. Wait. Some... Oh, am I going too fast? Sorry. Not I'll... that. Do you smell something? 
Yeah, I do. Smells like... Rain? You ruined everything! I earned that fucking hammer! But now, everyone's gonna think I only got it. Cause Magni's gone! Be a joke! But if I kill you, no one's gonna laugh at me. Oh, are you dumb? That your father's doing? Or did you get it from your mum? She's stupid and ugly. Shut up! It's true, but I'm gonna to get to know you really well. You're gonna be my new brother, right after I finish killing your father! Stop it! Ah! Ah! Oops, I think I broke him. <laughs> to get into Freya quickly. There's no other way. Take the boat. Freya's isn't far. Odin's eye is on you, brother. Especially now that you've taken to killing his kin. Hey, this forest is a blind spot for him. This is our smartest move. And if anyone can heal him, it's hard. What is happening to him? I've seen it in mortals that some conflict of the mind expresses itself as an ailment of the body. Never in a god. But a god believing himself mortal. I can only imagine. We're almost there. called the serpent.
burns hotter. He is shaking. It's serious. We must hurry. Urgent. I'm still a god. Go away. The boy has fallen ill. Freya! He's ill. Inside. This is no ordinary illness. The boy's true nature, your true nature, fights within him. found only in Helheim, the keeper that protects the Bridge of the Damned. I need its heart. Mm. Hell. The Realm of the Dead. Do you know it? Not this one. It is a land of unyielding gold. Fires cannot burn there, and no magic in all the Nine Realms can create a blaze. As for the dead, your frost axe will be useless. You'll need to find something else. Then I must return home. Dig up a past I swore would stay buried. Who you were before doesn't matter. This boy is not your past, he is your son. And he needs his father. This rune opens the bridge to Helheim. When you are there, do not, under any circumstances, cross the Bridge of the Damned. There is no road back. Understand? Boy. Himmele, you must hurry. Through my garden, there's a path leading to my boat. Take it. Return home. Dig up your past. Do whatever you need to do. Just bring me back the Bridge Keeper's heart, and your son may survive. Last we spoke, I was... No. You were right to distrust the word of a god. No need to explain. Not to me, not for that. I will keep him safe. That's a mother's promise. Oh. 